हेलो फ्रेंड्स बाय नाउ आई हैव हैड इनफ इनफ ऑफ माय सन ईटिंग आउट एट रेस्टोरेंट्स जस्ट फॉर दिस वन एपिटाइजर कॉल्ड क्रिस्पी कॉर्न सो आई डिसाइडेड टू शो हिम हाउ इजी इट इज टू मेक एंड हाउ ग्रेट वी कुड मेक इट बाय आवर सेल्स लेट्स बिगिन here i have taken one sweet corn folks there is an ultra easy method to separate the kernels of sweet corn pick a screw driver or a blunt knife and uproot one column of kernels like this and then it is easy to pull out the rest So here we are with the kernels. We also need three tablespoons corn flour, salt to taste, half teaspoon black salt, and half teaspoon garam masala. A few curry leaves, black pepper powder, and turmeric powder, one teaspoon each. And to boost the flavor of the dish and make it irresistible, some red chili flakes and oregano. First let us boil the corn kernels in a pressure cooker by adding salt and a glass of water for two whistles. Once the cooker is cool and the kernels are boiled, strain the water. Friends, you should always remember one point here. Crispy corn means the outer crust of the corn only should be crispy. deep inside the corn has to retain its softness and sweetness friends here we should mix all our ingredients when the corn is hot add garam masala black salt black pepper powder turmeric powder add corn flour and mix really well Here I have a trick up my sleeve. If you sprinkle some water, the kernels can take more corn flour and turn really crisp. Now drop the curry leaves and mix well. Heat oil in a pan. Oh yeah, the oil has heated up. Now let us deep fry the corn. Remember friends, the flame should be always high because the inside of the kernels is already boiled we only want a crunchy crust so in high flame only the crust gets crispy leaving the inners sweet and soft do you see the bubbles disappear well that means the corn is well fried transfer the corn to a paper towel so the oil gets absorbed The final step is to mix our chili flakes and oregano and mix real good. Is it the sound of crispy corn or is it the sound of happiness? That's it. Our corn is ready to serve. Serve this as an evening snack and even the kids next door will make you their favorite auntie. This is a lovely snack. and that of course goes without saying thanks for watching happy cooking love you friends